Hey, what's up? I'm coming here to bring you a quick little uh, Skyrim alchemy guide. So this is going to be about how to level your alchemy up pretty quick. The main things you're going to be looking at is you're going to be looking for Mora Tapanella, right? This stuff. Um, you're going to be looking for this ska uh, scaly for whatever, right? Um, and you're going to be looking for final one, which is really hard to harvest in these uh, gardens, which is creep cluster, right? So basically, <laughs> what you're going to want to do, if I can actually harvest any of this, um, is you're going to want to, whatever, I have some already, um, I think, I have like one. So basically, what you're going to want to do is get these three different ingredients and plant them in like a house garden. Right, you can just build the basic house. There's nothing in mine. You're just gonna want to plant them down. Um, but yeah, to find these, right, the mora um, tapanella is gonna be found near um, Riverwood, and really like all over the place around like fallen trees. So like, there's some like right over here. Like this tree spawns some. Like there it is, too, right there. I've harvested it recently, so um, it's not like showing up. But like these mushrooms and these trees by like Riverwood is where you're gonna find like quite a lot of it, um, and so that's gonna help. The next one, the um, Scaly Folita, you're gonna find around Iverstead and Riften, around um, dead birch trees, is where it's gonna be spawning, right? You're gonna want to look not at like the destroyed like. Um, husks of it or anything. There should be some like up here, I think. Basically, like the trick is to just kind of wander around aimlessly until you find some. But um see right here, there's a fallen birch tree with some scaly folicia on it. And the last one, creep cluster, is you're going to find it on the road going south from Windhelm. So near kind like south from Kynes Grove is where you're going to be able to um, find it. I've also harvested this recently on this character as I'm trying to level my alchemy. But um it shouldn't it's like it's a little bit far. There's just a random giant just vibing, I guess. Um, but there's creep cluster right here. He's kind of in the way. I'm just going to have to As you can see, you can harvest a little bit of creep cluster um, and ignore the giant. Um, you know, what are you going to do with all this? Well, you're going to combine it, the ingredients, right? So I'm going to quickly uh, travel over to Whiterun and show you what these uh, different ingredients actually do together. Because it's actually pretty, pretty kind of, pretty cool, right? I work with my mother. Because they make, um, they make a pretty high, highly valuable potion, which is also going to be a way for you to make quite a bit of money. Because every about two to three days, that farm should respawn. And so what you're looking for here is creep cluster, um, the mushrooms that have Latin sounding names. And so this is going to make this potion of fortify carry weight, increase car carrying capacity, stamina regen, illusion spell strength, magic vulnerability, and restores magicka. And so like you can see, that's like a big chunk of alchemy like gone up if I had more creep cluster um, the creep cluster is really hard to harvest in the farm and sometimes it will bug out and stop growing and you'll have to replant it um, I've heard that this can be solved by building the greenhouse and putting in the pots but I haven't personally tried it yet um, but yeah that's an easy way for you to get ingredients and to make good potions to level your alchemy skill and these potions are gonna sell for quite a bit of money as you can see in here, they are um, somewhere. They're worth about 557 gold for me not right now, a piece. And my alchemy skill is only at like 40. That's quite a bit of gold. It's going to help you um, get money to for your other crafting skills. Anyway, uh, that's my Skyrim Alchemy Guide. Uh, thanks for watching. Goodbye.